Okay. I mean, those guys, these guys are annoying, but they're not super scary at the moment. What are you? You were in among them. You're not one of them. Oh, that's the first enemy I've seen that can actually do, like, damage to others. You got a Titanite Shard in you. I'm gonna go check out what's down this way. Oh, it's the giant. I think the giant is friends with me. So he's just helping me clear them. I'm going to... Oh, Undead Bone Shard. That's big. Nice. I'm just going to hope that he is not targeting me. He's doing great. <laughs> I'm so happy to see these now. And this... Oh, it's another... Is this another White Birch? Is that why? Is he like... Young White Branch? Yeah. I don't know why he targets uh, enemies near these these branch or these birch trees, but I am happy that he is here to help me. <laughs> Always good news to have friends. All right, so that cathedral up there looks uh, intimidating. Night Shard. I cannot go this way. Visions of Rear. Dry Finger. Oh, man. <laughs> Great Shield. Okay. Oh, I picked up a weapon. It was called like the Astora Greatsword, I think. Let me see if that's worth using. Broadsword. Astora Straight Sword. If Erythil? Erythil? Executioner's Greatsword is a C and E. A Store Greatsword is a DC, so that's not very good. Exile Greatsword is a C. So the one I have is still A, but I can't really modify it. So I might want to switch to a weapon that can be modified to improve it. I have to decide what kind of infusion I'd want to go for. I liked the raw and the heavy one, although the raw is not going to be affected by my modifier at all. This is, this is the death ladder. Oh, kick. Now it is no longer a death ladder, it is a real ladder. And if I fall down into the leech pit, I can actually come back up here. That is good news. But what is here? What is, what is up here? That's imposing. Rusted coin, I think that increases my drop rate for certain just like drops from enemies. Red bug pellet. Staggered. Oh, I, I noticed you there. Don't you worry. I also see the crossbow guy up above. 
Let me see if, uh, this big door is a boss or a bonfire. Does not open from this side, you know what? It is neither. It is, uh, an obstacle. Ooh, I lured the crossbow guy down, though. With my indecision. What? Don't know where you came from, but thank you for announcing your presence very loudly. It's a weird looking spike. I don't like any of this. Be wary of right. Oh, hey, thanks for the warning. There are enemies down there. Do I have, would I have to jump? No, I could drop right here to get there. Okay. Oh no. I'm dead. Uh, that's that was brutal. <laughs> uh, I got a crap load of souls. I'm gonna have to figure out how to get those. I've lost my ember though. That's kind of sad. I don't even know how many embers I have. Fifteen. I think there was something over this way I wanted to check before I, uh... Oh, no, that's just a dead end. That just takes me down to the leech. That's nothing good. All this is just going to take me down to the leech. Although, actually, now that's not such a bad thing because I had to kick down the ladder. And I can skip the whole, uh, graveyard here if I drop down here and get on that ladder. I didn't even have to deal with the leech. Tis quite the long ladder though. But that was a nice shortcut to unlock. So I went up here and over here. This lady. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. My souls. You are not allowed to kill me right now. You fucker. You and the crossbow guy are both going to pay for that scare. Ugh. Oh my god, his aim, though. Can you come down here for a second? Just d desperately rolling to avoid it. Can you... God, you know what? Fuck it. If I just go down here, you're not going to be able to come to me. All right. First things first is I need my souls back. I'm going to drop down here, grab my souls, run past the lady before she corners me. At least this way I have some uh, leeway. Low on health. Oh, 
Oh, she got me. How did... I didn't realize my health was that low. Fuck. I didn't realize my health was low. I thought I was doing okay, but clearly I'm an idiot. Alright. I need to not rush. I need to... I need to... Still sensibly get to where I want to go. That dude was coming for me. Imagine he could climb ladders. That would be nightmare fuel. I think I'm safe. Alright. The, uh, lady thing, I'm going to deal with just... I'm gonna expect that I have to fight you, and not try and run past you. Alright. Got you. Kill that guy first. here. I am going to do, once again, just basically bum rush to get my souls back and then deal with the consequences. They're down there. I do have more room to contend with here. Dodge the suicide bomber. Do you mind? The next bonfire I get to, I'm going to go and uh, spend my souls for sure. I've got too many to, uh, I've got too many to risk. Okay. Ambush ahead. Oh, it is these, these dudes. I haven't seen you in a while. I don't want to get near the lady. Thrall axe, is that where you are? You're a thrall? Alright. Well, he just damaged her, so I'll take that. Alright, lady. You gave me more trouble than you should have. I'm gonna be honest with you. Undead hunter charm. Uh, I don't know what that does. Prevents Estus recovery with a limited area. Okay. Probably not something I'm ever gonna use. <laughs> I know myself too well. Fire bombs. I think those are going into storage. I think that's that green symbol that I was seeing. Okay, so there is a bridge here that I can go up. Ambushers. It's the dude with the big sword. 
I guess I've gotten considerably stronger though, because I remember him taking a bit more of a beating. <laughs> oh my god! Oh yeah, I'm alive. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was I thought I was dead for sure. Somehow not dead. I'll be honest, I should be. <laughs> I should straight up just be dead. These guys really enjoy just blowing themselves up. You good here, friend? Sorry, I don't... I don't really tr uh, let the you guys that are acting like nothing's gonna happen because uh, I don't believe you. I was out of stamina because I kept swinging at you. All right, that was the guy that climbed up on the to try and ambush me from behind. So this is the path that I could have taken uh, if I didn't drop down to go and deal with the lady. Uh. If I miss this jump, I just, I'm just dead. I think I could get up there, but I don't, not at the moment, I don't want to do it. I'm hoping that I'll get a shortcut or something up here. Pretty hard. I want a bonfire or a shortcut to a bonfire, please. God. All these ambushers. I missed you for a little bit. Now I don't. I'm out of Estus. Ah, he's throwing knives at me. Deep gem. Is that a uh, like a yeah, it's a uh, used to make deep weapons. Okay. I was hoping for a bonfire, <laughs> but I'm always hoping for a bonfire. There's more. There's more of you. <laughs> I don't understand. Above. Is there another one? They just keep coming. It's just a non-stop wave of them. How many were there? You're still alive, somehow. And he just threw something weird at me. All right, I did not need to take that extra damage there. I need safety. Huh, it's an ambush. Once again, I feel like I could try jumping on there, but not with the souls that I have. there is scary to me. No, oh, there's two of them. I was already thinking about l returning <laughs> when I saw just one of them. Now I see two of them.
I don't know what's down there. So even though I may be right near a shortcut, I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to rest. <laughs> So I need to keep working on my strength. Let's put two into strength. Let's also get one more dexterity. I should just try to put dexterity whenever I can. Vitality makes it so that I can carry more. So maybe I'll put a couple points in there too. Can I use a new weapon yet? I can use the Great Machete, but that's a D. It's 167. It's a great axe, while the Butcher Knife is classified as an axe. Large club. Great club. It's a great hammer. They're both great hammers. I have 95 plus 75. Halberd seem to be a mix. The Exile Greatsword, I still need more dexterity for. The Astora Greatsword, I need more dexterity for. The Executioner's Greatsword, I can use. Uh, don't care about guarding, I just mostly, I just try and dodge. This is a Greatsword. The Astora Greatsword's an Ultra Greatsword. Like, I do have to, th th like, greatly consider the, the weapons that I choose to use. 95 plus 75 puts me at 170 total damage per swing. So if I pick a weapon that's going to be slower, it needs to do considerably more damage. One of the nice things about the knife was that I could... Oh, I guess I'm currently one-handing. I do like the the range on this thing. What do the heavy attacks look like? Okay, just friggin' batter swing. That uses up, like, most of my stamina. Thankfully, it's not too slow to wind it up. Oh, how's my fat rolling? Fat. <laughs> uh, I need to drop 6%. I guess I said I could switch these legs out. There's something a little... Currently I have 8.8. .8. Okay, just switching those legs right there was enough. Okay, I honestly couldn't remember if I had actually gotten an Undead Bone Shard or not, but I think I did get Ashes. Any new keys? No, just the tower key that's 20,000. I will eventually want to grab that. Boosts damage absorption when HP is full. Yeah, because my HP is frequently topped off. <laughs> I want a big hat. I know the big hat's not going to really give me any defense, but I just for the fashion fashion souls. All right.
Uh, let me think. I'm trying to think about pathways, ways to go. I think I honestly only have, like, the way I'm currently going. Hey there. I hope you're enjoying the videos of the Dark Souls 3 adventure with me and my best friend. I'd love to hear what you all think, so please leave a like or a comment and consider subscribing to follow my journey to beat as many games as I can. Thank you for taking the time to watch, and I'll see you in the next one.